On the spectrum of quality emperors of Rome, Trajan is darn near the tippy-top summit, if not the summit's co-occupant alongside Augustus. As we've said before, the second century was the absolute sweetest time to live in ancient Rome, and the man most emblematic of the era's peace and prosperity is certainly the emperor Trajan. He was a brilliant soldier who spearheaded the second greatest military expansion of Rome, and in fact, under his rule, the empire attained its greatest geographic extent. Trajan introduced what seemed to be a pretty robust system of social welfare, though this is somewhat disputed, and constructed magnificent new public works like Trajan's Forum, Trajan's Market, and Trajan's Column. If you build it, you get to put your name on it. His single greatest accomplishment was probably the conquering of the kingdom of Dacia, modern-day Romania which Julius Caesar had intended to invade, but well, you know. He may or may not have committed genocide against the Dacian people, we just don't know. But modern Romanian is a Romance language, and one of their most popular baby names remains Trajan. The new province was absolutely filthy with gold, which allowed Trajan to comfortably enrich himself and the Roman people. He also went to war with Parthia, and unlike every Roman before him who'd gone to war with Parthia, did not get BTFO. Again, brilliant soldier. After a period of illness, he died in 117, and the Senate declared him Optimus Princeps, best ruler.